We're at the Baker Creek Preserve. I'm with Alex Clark. He's from Knoxville Outdoor Tours. We're sitting in front of the bike jump line. Off camera, you said that we've kind of played little brother to Western North Carolina and their outdoor recreation activities. We have a lot of stuff to offer here, don't we? Certainly, certainly. And and I think it's it's funny. We, a, a lot of folks are traveling to Western North Carolina for these outdoor recreation activities. And uh, we've got the same mountains. It, we're, we're sharing the same thing. And, and we want to come out here and, and try to expose those and, and let people enjoy it from, from our side of the mountains. So Alex, tell us about your business. So Knoxville Outdoor Tours is, is a brainchild that I got chartered through the state on February 15th. And then as we're all aware in March, things went a little south. Uh, but the initial idea here and, and something that's been working really well is I've been a, a, a mountain biker for a number of years and, and I wanted to show other people that are traveling here on such a large basis. Um, it's not fun when maybe you go up a trail the wrong way or you start on in a wrong place that's not as much fun. And so I'm a mountain bike guide. Uh, people come here, they contact me and my, my, what I like to say is put away the maps. I know all the good stuff. We're doing a lot of stuff at the county with Parks and Rec with our water trails. We're working on the Beaver Creek uh, Trail as well as Holston River. We have an exciting project coming up here. Combine the water trails with the bike trails and Knox County, East Tennessee can really become an outdoor recreational destination. You're totally right. And, and I think a lot of the times uh, the, the folks that are doing those activities are one and the same. And so we've got a lot of, a lot of folks coming here and, and maybe they're riding bikes on Saturday and then they're taking their kayaks on, out on Sunday. And having the blue ways mixed with uh, the, the dirt trails, it really, people come here and can just be outside the entire, their entire trip. We have that building up there at the entrance to Baker Creek Preserve. It seems to me like this is a gateway to not only the urban wilderness, but just all of this stuff. And, Tell us about plans uh, for the building and uh, it's kind of a hub for all of the activities happening here. Yeah, the, the, it's, the idea is for it to be a destination. And, and so we're taking these little steps to make that happen. Uh, it's really one of those things where we're, Knoxville is already on the map, but you, if you build it, they will come in a way. And, and so we've got Baker Creek Bottoms, which is a wonderful development project uh, that is in the midst of getting started right now. And, and so that, that would bring a concert hall, a brewery, a bike shop, all these great things right at the footstep of these trails. And then James White Parkway is where really the idea is for all this to start. For the past couple of years, USA Cycling has had their championships here and we'll have those for the next few years as well, thanks to Visit Knoxville. How has that impacted the cycling community here in, in Knox County in East Tennessee? The terrain is so conducive to making it a challenging yet rewarding ride, whether that's on the road or in the mountains. And really just getting uh, all these athletes here to see the culture and, and the great restaurants, uh, the beer scene, the, the kayaking scene. There's so many great things Knoxville has to offer. Alex, thanks for your time. Good luck with everything that you're doing here. This is really amazing stuff. I don't really trust myself to get on this trail because I'm not that advanced but can we go hit the trails? I'm excited to show you around, Mr. Mayor. Let's do it.